Hello and welcome to Interactive CAD and Tech. Uh, today I'm going to be going through how you model a twist and ring in SOLIDWORKS. It's a nice simple tutorial for beginners on how you twist and shape bodies. Uh, so just to get started I'm going to go up to sketch and I'm going to draw a sketch on the front plane. So this sketch is going to have a square on it that's 50 by 50. So 50 mil and then I'll make, I'll put a constraint on the top line of equal to fully define the sketch. I'm going to exit this sketch and I'm going to extrude uh, this this sketch um, a meter. So if I go to features, extrude, I'm going to extrude it a meter. Um, in fact, let's make it a little bit bigger, 1150. But I'm going to change the direction to mid plane. Um, so this helps when you're bending it. So now either side of the sketch is halved and extruded out. So I'll just tick that. So now what I'm going to do is just add some colours to the... So if I go to appearance, scenes and decals on the right hand side. And then I'm going to go to colour, appearance colour. I'm going to go to solids. And we're going to just make each face of this um, bar a different colour. So when you twist it, you get an, a little effect. So I'll just go to face. So I'll just go down. So I'm going to make this face orange. So I'm dragging and dropping onto the surface. And then it comes up with this little bar where you can do the entire part, the body, your feature. But we want to do the face. So I'll just do it again for the, for the other side. So I'll go down to yellow. And do the same again for green. So now I have a multicolored bar where each each face has a different color on. So now what I'm going to do is twist this solid body. So to do that, you need to go to uh, insert features and go down to flex. So this is a handy little tool that lets you bend bodies, twist them and taper them and stretch them. So to make this a twisting ring, what I need to do is select the body. And then I need to go to twisting because I want to actually twist the part. And what I need to do then is twist it by um, 200. No, let's do it. Let's put a big twist in it. 720 degrees. And tick it. So now, as you can see, it's twisted the body. So it's kept where the both planes are flat. So if I go back, edit the flex again. It's kept where my trim planes are flat. And twisted the actual body in between each plane. So I'll just tick that again. So from there, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back up to insert and uh, features and go back to flex and add another flex into this body. And this one's going to be bending. So, in, so I'm going to bend it um, by a degrees from the middle. So the bend axis is there. And then you've got your trim plane there and there. So the bend axis is where I'm going to bend it from. And then the trim plane is where it's affected. So what I'm going to do is put the degrees in of 300, sorry, 359. Because if I go 360, it makes an error. So now that's that degrees. So there's a gap in it. And there you go. Model the twisting ring in SOLIDWORKS. I hope you found this little tutorial helpful. If you have, please subscribe to my channel to support. And thanks for watching.